Howdy folks, Tax Grabner here with Tax Grabner Outdoors. Hope you guys are ready for your Tax Grabner Outdoors Saturday morning cartoon awesomeness. If you guys want to support the channel in a way beyond simply watching the videos, you can go to TaxGrabnerOutdoors.com, check out the Make It Weird sticker, the Make It Weird shirt. The Life Ain't Like the Pornos Hunt Ain't Like the TV Show shirt, because by God ain't that the truth. And my personal favorite, the Kill With Stick shirt. Also, make sure to leave a comment if you'd be interested in a hashtag outlaw trad life shirt, because if there's enough interest, we may add that to the store as well. Really appreciate everybody that's bought the Tex Grabner Outdoors merchandise over the past couple of years. I honestly never thought we'd sell anything at all. With that all being said, if you guys want a discount on all your trad life supplies and to show your support for Tex Grabner Outdoors in the process, use the code of Tex Grabner in your checkout at Three Rivers Archery. Not a big discount, but every little bit helps. Time to get ready for the hunting season. We're going to be talking about a precision slug gun from Aria Ballistic Engineering, but more importantly, some super alloy full bore devastators that are safe to shoot through a rifled barrel because they are super alloy lead. Because who knows if you're going to be able to find Sabos this year. I can only show a product to be as good as I can actually use it. That's just the way that it is. If I don't shoot good, the product doesn't look good. Now you also need to understand there isn't going to be any ballistic testing in this video because since I have an addiction to raw power, by the time that I actually caught one of these devastator slugs, it would probably take like a railroad tie worth of ballistic gel. It would be like, you know, your regular old deer slug. This is like a moose slug. And we're throwing in this video a 750 grain super hard alloy lead conical. Not a hollow foster, not swage lead, none of that. We're throwing a 750 grain solid lead, but they also make hollow points, at 1400 feet a second. So we're dealing with raw power here. These devastator loads from Aria Ballistic Engineering are super hard alloy lead, which means that you can shoot them out of a rifled barrel. Not gonna lie, this ammo will shoot a ragged hole at 50 yards out of a rifled barrel off the bench. This has a 109 TKO rating. A Sabo two and three quarter compared to a Devastator two and three quarter is like comparing a 4570 to a 458 lock. So I love the lead sled for accuracy testing because you can shoot some really awesome groups and it takes all the recoil out of it. The downside is it adds length between the scope and your eye, which makes parallax an issue and it makes it very difficult to get directly behind the scope. So in this case, I wasn't necessarily shooting for dead center. I was more shooting for the group. When I say that this is a custom precision slug gun, you probably think, yeah, whatever, big deal. It's a Mossberg 500 with a rifled cantilever barrel. Whatever. Now hear me out because I'm nobody's shell. The truth is, and this is unfortunate, and I say it with all due respect to the gunsmithing community, if you aren't looking for a drill and tap 
get your scope bases mounted and get a half-assed bore sight. And oh, by the way, it's going to be 45 bucks a hold at Rill and Tap. Gunsmiths these days are practically useless. This is a bespoke level of gunsmithing. Aria Ballistic Engineering is a custom ammunition shop, a custom gun shop. We're not at the Holland and Holland, Wesley Richards, Heim, or John Rigby level, but we are in the bespoke level of gunsmithing, actual custom gun precision work. Now that I've got that out of the way, this gun is a precision slug gun. You saw me shoot a ragged hole off the bench, even if I wasn't really hitting dead center because I couldn't get behind the scope. I used a little bit of Kentucky windage to hit at 100 yards, and obviously you saw me shoot directly under the MOA bullseye at 50 yards again off my knee. So this gun with the Devastators shoots as good as I can shoot it. We have a custom, fluted, fully rifled barrel. Obviously it's cantilevered, so it doesn't have any fancy safari or express sights on it. We also have a custom recoil management strap underneath the forearm of the pump action. We have a blueprinted action. As I said, Aria Ballistic Engineering is bottom to top, front to back, actual gunsmithing. So this is a precision action in a Mossberg 500 build. We also have a super sweet trigger because the trigger in a slug gun is your nemesis because slugs can tend to not be real fun to shoot and the standard slug gun trigger that most of us are used to is like metal stuck against metal. You're anticipating the recoil and you literally get it over with by jerking the trigger to the rear. In this case, this is an actual precision trigger. Of course, we have a recoil pad on the back side of the trigger guard so that you don't bash the crap out of your shooting hand. We have a shark fin on top of the stock for an actual Monte Carlo style comb. Even if we don't have the pancake on the side of the stock, which doesn't really matter because we're using a scope anyway. And we have a really good recoil pad here. And I mean good because I've shot Devastators, Big Game Slugs, and Thunderbolts out of a Benelli Nova with the standard recoil pad and it was miserable. This is a good recoil pad. Now, speaking of the Devastator loads, don't be scared of them. They are a full bore slug. They're safe to shoot out of rifled barrels. They are standard in two and three quarter inch. However, as I said, this is custom ammunition and custom guns. You can get the Devastator in a 750 grain slug in a 3 inch, and even the 12 gauge from hell, the Devastator 3.5 inch, if you have a gun built for that. The 12 gauge from hell is basically like an elephant slug. I mean, the 3.5 inch Devastators are pretty much like a lower pressured version of a 577 Nitro Express. I know that I mentioned the recoil being substantial, which is true, but it's not unmanageable. One shot meat, two shot maybe, three shot son of a bitch. That's just the way that it is. Your first shot is really the only one that counts. Now, I'm making this video not only because I'm partnered up with Aria Ballistic Engineering, but seeing as this is a crazy year, hunting season's probably going to roll around, and the shelves are going to be empty because of all the panic buying. So I wanted to make sure that you guys found out about this ammunition well in advance if you were wanting to order some of these Devastator slugs. While I'm at it, not everybody's got a 375 h and h not everybody's got a 458 lot, 
but Arioballistic Engineering has everything between 30-06 to 505 Gibbs. So you might want to check it out if you're looking for some high-end hunting ammunition in case you can't find what you're looking for this fall in your local stores. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this week's episode of Texas Grabbing Your Outdoors. As always, God bless all my sportsmen of America. Join the NRA to protect your rights. Please count my friends over at threeriversarchery.com. Thank you very much to those of you involved in law enforcement, you good cops out there, and those of you serving the military ready to die for freedom anywhere. And thanks for watching Texas Grabbing Your Outdoors.